a trans person. This person is, is I don't know how far they trans, so I'm just going to say trans person, uh, went out of their way to attack a black woman because they felt like the black woman was not in support of the trans community, which is the new superpower of minorities. All right. They are the new superpower of minorities. All right. So that's where we are right now. And, and since they believe they are the new superpower of minorities, you have to bow down to them or else. Ran into me because you're a transphobe and you're having a bad I life. I have trans friends. So why did you walk into me like that? You're looking for problems and you're purposely Am antagonizing I? me. Am I? So I'm going to give you a minute and then I'm going to call the cops because you're you was going in that direction and now you're following me to this location you, and i'm gonna stand here for me. one minute you antagonize me I, okay what's and your you're name a, you're a black woman calling a, what's your name? a trans woman and i just want you to what's think, your name i want you to think about that okay uh, you're a black woman calling the cops on a trans and i want you to think about that because you're not supposed to call the cops on other people who go through the same things as black people if you don't get the hell out of my face. I've, You're a black woman calling a cops go ahead. on a trans go, woman. Continue to walk. And I want you to think about that. We're at 37 I'm, seconds. I'm going to pray for you. I'm going to hang. Because I pray. I'm going to stop recording at one minute, and I'm going to call the cops if you're still in my I area. Pray. I haven't offended you, you in any way. You hit me on the sidewalk you're with your body. Me. You hit me. It, honey. It's what? not honey okay. anymore, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, cuz threw his mask, cuz threw his wig off. Was like, <laughs> it's not honey anymore, bitch. <laughs> Hold on, this is hilarious. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be laughing at this, but guess what? I am. Feel free to call me whatever you want to call me. I don't care, I can care less. And more of you need to be the same way. Stop trying to appease these people. I'm talking about anybody. Don't try to appease anyone at all. Let them call you misogynist. Let them call you sexist. Let them call you racist. Let them call you whatever they want to call you. If you know you aren't that, let it roll off your shoulders. Who cares? But this is absolutely hilarious. I'm sorry. Honey. It's what? not honey okay. anymore, bitch. It's <laughs> not honey. Okay. It's not honey. We're just going to patiently wait for the time. <laughs> yes, we are. This is getting. You're a hypocrite. It's You're a liberal a hypocrite. Okay, sir. Oh, I listen. I'm, and I'm saying this with all love. I think. I think cause look better with the wig on. I think you should put the wig back on, sir. You look better with the wig on. In my opinion, we have been teaching people how to grow online. It's been absolutely amazing. We have three people who have been able to reach monetization in less than 30 days. Growing YouTube channels, some from zero people. We have one guy who had two subscribers before he started working with me. He started helping him. His views went up 4.8 million percent. We're super excited. If anybody ever want to grow on YouTube, you reach out to me with the word coach. No, no diddy. You know what I mean? I, you know what I mean? I just, okay, let's go. I'm just saying, I, I see why main man is wearing a wig. That's all I'm going to say. I see why main man is wearing a wig. And you're a I am aggressive. I'm PTSD. Okay. You the wrong tranny today. I apologize. I'm sorry. That's what you should be doing. You should be deleting that video. I, I will not. Because I feel. I have I feel, a lawyer. I have two and three okay. lawyers, honey. I this dude said I have a lawyer. I have two and three, honey's lawyer. I have two and three lawyers, honey. <laughs> I'm sorry. This should not be so funny to me. All right. I'm sorry. I'm not stopping it again. We're going to run through it. Okay. Lady, that video. I, I will not. Because I feel. I have I feel, a lawyer. I have two and three okay. lawyers, honey. I will sue your pants I'm not going to speak bitch. anymore. Okay? I will sue your pants off. I'm not speaking anymore. Good. I risk my life every day getting ready in the morning, and you have the, the temerity to hit me with your body. I don't know if you guys. You risk your life every day to get ready in the morning? I'm sorry, that wins. That wins, in my opinion. That wins as one of the 
dumbest things that was said throughout the entirety of this video. I'm, I apologize, but that wins. Okay. Hit me with your body. I don't know if you guys noticed, but my hands are shaking. Because Thank I you, Deborah. Currently because Thank you, Deborah. You need to go. Alone. You need therapy. And you know what? You'd be better off in the hood because the hood people, they know how to act. Okay. It they sounds... know how we treat each other. You hear that? Did y'all hear that? This is a white Democrat trans person who told a black lady that you would be better off in the hood because hood people know how to treat trans people because they realize that we the same as them. You know, they realize we the same. I just now said that I was just going to run it and not stop it again. I apologize, man. I'm not a man of my word, clearly. You went, you went to Bard. You have a master's, you have an MBA. I am currently a starting to shake white more because this individual would not thing. leave me alone. You! I have PTSD from being assaulted by people like you. And by that I mean insecure. I'm not a racist, in case that's where you're gonna, you know, oh, racist trans woman attacks me on sidewalk. You assaulted me on the sidewalk and then- You are actually racist as hell. You actually are. And, uh, the Democrat whites are, in my opinion, the most racist of all races, in my opinion. No, it's not even Democrat whites. It's just Democrats. <laughs> because we feel like we have the right to. It's like we've been, we've been given the green light to be racist. Y'all heard Malcolm X. Don't try to act like you ain't heard what Malcolm X said about the whites, the Democrat whites. You assaulted me on the sidewalk and then you called the I cops think I on see me. lights coming down. Good taking so long i looked better than you and you couldn't handle it because you have internalized misogyny internalized femphobia internalized homophobia you're an angry young lady you're an angry young woman and i i i really wish we could be friends but that does not give you the right to hit me on the sidewalk because what you did you assaulted me ma'am yeah please <laughs> I wanted to see that, man. I wanted to see that. Why did they stop it? Who who's responsible for this video? Huh? Who's responsible for this video? Clown World? It was Clown World. See, look, Clown World. Clown world, why did you cut it off right there? I wanted to see the rest of that, man. No, I wanted to see it. <laughs> Hopefully they would have jumped out the day going cruising and tackled the, the person. Because you got to be careful what you call them nowadays. You do. I thought that was absolutely ridiculous. And they tried to virtue signal many times. This person, that man, that's 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 the man that's into me. The man that's a new woman accused the woman of being being a black person that didn't know how to be black because uh, um, clearly they should be more accepting of trans individuals because they're just like black community, which is dumb as hell. Gay people, I need y'all to stop saying that. That's stupid as hell, okay? LGBTQAI+, you, are, you guys are nowhere near like anything that black Americans went through. And we should stop comparing that as well. But I just want to address that, all right? Because what we went through is not what we went through, it's what our ancestors went through. We go through freedom. We go through not having to look over our backs for slave masters anymore. That's what we go through. We go to our jobs and, our, and we go to sporting events and wherever the hell we want to go. And when we're going to the ATM machine, just like uh, Chris Rock pointed out, we are not looking over our shoulders for no police. We looking over our shoulders. I'm not even going to finish that because I don't want to start no sugar honey iced tea up in here, up in here. Okay.